Hello everyone, welcome to solve this nice math Olympiad algebra problem. So here we have m plus n equals to 9 and m n equals to also 9. And we solve this problem for the values of m and n. So here first we call this is our equation number 1 and we call this is our equation number 2. And now here first we focus on equation number 1. And in equation number 1 is implies that here if we move this m to the right hand side and it will be written as n equals to 9 minus m and we call this is our equation number 3. So now here we need to substitute this value of n in equation number 2 so that here our equation number 2 is implies that this is m times of n so we have m and the value of n is 9 minus m and this is equals to 9 okay so here we need a some simplification so that here uh, we just multiply this m on both of these terms and it will be written as 9m minus m square equals to 9 so here further uh, you see that it will uh, become uh, quadratic in m variable but not in standard form so that now we first convert this into the standard form so we move these two terms to the right hand side uh, you see here this is minus m square when we move in the right hand side it will become plus m square this is plus 9m it will become minus 9m and this is plus 9 equals to 0. So now you see here <clears throat> this equation will become uh, standard form uh, so here this is quadratic equation so we apply the quadratic formula so that now here first we write the coefficients of this equation and its coefficients are a equals to 1 and b equals to minus 9 c equals to plus 9 okay so these are the coefficients of the above equation and uh, now we uh, write here the quadratic formula so quadratic formula is stated as m equals minus b plus minus square root of b square minus 4 times of ac divided by 2 times of a this is the our quadratic formula and now we substitute the values of a b and c in this quadratic formula so here uh, we need to substitute these three values in this equation and it will be written as m equals this is minus b the value of b is minus 9 and plus minus square root of b square so b is minus 9 square minus 4 times of a is 1 and c is 9 and it is divided by 2 times of a so here our a is equals to 1. So now here we need more simplifications and you see here this is minus times of minus becomes plus 9 and plus minus square root of this is minus 9 square equals to 81 and 4 times of 9 becomes 36 and it is divided by 2. So here <clears throat> we need more simplification and uh, we just write it as m equals 9 plus minus square root of this is uh, 81 minus 36 and we know that it is equals to uh, 45 and it is divided by 2 okay so uh, you see here these are the two values of uh, m and uh, now we just write these values separately here so now first we write the positive value it is m equals to 9 plus minus here we write the positive value 9 plus square root of 45 divided by 2 and here we write the negative value it will be written as 9 minus square root of 45 and it is divided by 2 okay so these are the two values of m and now here our next target is to find the corresponding values of n uh, so here uh, equation number 3 is implies that uh, in equation number 3 we have n equals to 9 minus m and now uh, the time to uh, substitute both of these values in this equation and we get the corresponding values of n and now here uh, we just first 
substitute uh, this value of m here and it will be written as n equals to 9 minus m and the value of m is 9 plus uh, square root of 45 divided by 2 so here we need to just copy down this equation here so here we uh, take the LCM of this term and its LCM becomes 2 and here you have 2 times of 9 becomes 18 minus these two is cancelled by each other and you get 9 plus square root of 45. So now here parallel we substitute this value of m here and you get the second value of n is equals to 9 minus m and in that case we have the value of m is 9 minus 45 square root and it is divided by 2 okay so we have uh, these two cases so we need to uh, solve these two cases and we get the corresponding values of n so now we multiply this negative sign on both of these terms and it will be written as 18 minus 9 minus square root of 45 divided by 2 and we have 18 minus 9 becomes 9 minus square root of 45 divided by 2 and this is the value of n this is the value of n uh, corresponding to uh, the value of uh, m is uh, this one 9 plus square root of 45 divided by 2 so this is the value of n and corresponding the value of n is this one so now here we need to simplify uh, this equation so uh, here uh, we again need to take the lcm of this equation and its lcm r2 and we have 2 times of 9 becomes 18 minus the remaining term r9 minus square root of 45 here we need uh, some simplification and now we multiply this negative sign on both of these terms and it will be written as 18 minus 9 plus square root of 45 divided by 2 and you get the value of n equals to 18 minus 9 is 9 plus square root of 45 divided by 2. So this is the second value of n and uh, corresponding to uh, this value of n the value of m is 9 minus square root of 45 divided by 2 so this is the second value of m so finally we have uh, two solutions of the given equation and the first solution is m n equals to 9 plus square root of 45 divided by 2 and 9 minus square root of 45 divided by 2 and the second value of m n is equals to uh, the second uh, solution is uh, 9 minus square root of 45 divided by 2 and 9 plus uh, square root of 45 divided by 2 so these are the two solutions of the given equation and this is the final answer and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos.